And welcome to our Sunday soiree in the Sussex countryside. What a beautiful day it is. Lewis Hamilton, Sir Sterling Moss, Lord March. Are you ready for some motorsport fun, boys? I am. We are. Yeah, we certainly, certainly are. are. That's the idea. Excellent. T thank you for the invitation, by the way. It's Pleasure. very nice of you to welcome us back again. Tens of thousands of motorsport fans are here as well. Everyone's enjoying themselves. We feel the need for the Festival of Speed. <laughs> There's no doubting on the world stage, the Laureus Sports Awards are something that every athlete, every sports star wants to put in their trophy cabinet. 15 years they've been going, Michael Schumacher and Lewis Hamilton have been beneficiaries in the past. Up for the Sports Team of the Year and in Sebastian Vettel's case, Sports Man of the Year. Is there enough room for two more trophies at their Milton Keynes base? He's 26 years old, you know, I mean that in alone is, is an achievement to be behind the wheel of a Formula One racing car, but to be world champion that many times over is just extraordinary. So, this is what it's like to drive a Formula One car. Oh my God. I cannot begin to express the feelings that you get when you go and you just put your foot down for the first time and your stomach goes and you get the seventh gear in seconds and you miss an apex because you didn't even know it was there, quite frankly. But it's, it's just amazing. Go on, you've got, to get, you've got to get out now. I don't want to ever, I don't want to ever get out, boys. I can barely hear you above the noise. They're clapping, not just for last week's race, but our two special guests tonight as well. Keep the applause going, ladies and gentlemen. Johnny Herbert and Karun Chandler. Let's go to Crofty, our man in the sand. Sand absolutely everywhere this is going to be the ultimate challenge i think for our four king drivers today uh, we have jumps we have blind apexes we have corners that come literally out of nowhere they're going to feel the heat simon lazenby me and you cooler than a fridge full of eskimos too right magnificent stuff disappointing this is ridiculous That's disappointing ridiculous. you were told to bring the car straight back to the pits you carried on <laughs> didn't apply your brakes i'm sorry lewis so how am i not on board you get a 10 second penalty for benefiting yeah. from the bollard being kicked away are uh, you kidding me yeah because your your line was far too wide you how do i get a penalty for that <laughs> because i'm in charge <laughs> smiles are plenty for phil taylor and he's still here on the hockey grinning away what a match that was, that was a cracker. Simon was, was br brilliant there. Now that is no ordinary school playground. Come to think of it, these are no ordinary teachers' cars either. And this is no ordinary school. It's the Silverstone UTC, the breeding ground for future Formula One engineers. And today, with their patron, Adrian Newey, attending, is their grand opening. Let's take a look inside. Is it me, or did it look an awful lot warmer when Sebastian Vettel was talking as to how it does now? I don't know if it looks it, it feels a lot colder. Oh, come and have a hug, Pink. She's freezing, Whoa. bless her little heart. Uh, my Sebastian, not packing appropriately. No, no, uh, I think jeans and a jumper would have been appropriate for the weather tonight, but that's not very Monaco, is it now? Pinks, there is a glass of champagne right Ooh. over there with our name on it. It's party night in Monaco, it's Thursday. Have you brought your dancing shoes? <laughs> As long as I'm not dancing with you, because it's a bit like going to a party with your uncle. I'm going to throw some shapes, some of which you've never <laughs> seen before. Don't miss Jolie and Palmer on pole for GP2 tomorrow in the feature race. We'll be back with the F1 show a little bit later on. Have a great night. Goodbye from Monaco. Bye. Johnny Herbert, I brought you to the other side of the track, the side that the drivers never, ever experience. Are you ready for this? I'm ready for this, Crofty. This is Goodwood. Glorious Goodwood. <laughs> We're all on our best behaviour, and there's a reason for that. It's because Lord March is walking around as well and keeping an eye on the place. This the is the middle. man behind the Festival of Speed. Good afternoon. Hi. Welcome. Nice to see you. And nice to see you again. What a wonderful event. Once more, the 22nd Festival of Speed. Well, it's fair to say, Ted, that the only people with a greater access all areas pass than yourself this weekend are right in front of us here uh, from the Starlight Children's Foundation. Boys, how are we? Right, fantastic. But whose car did you go in? I want to know more about this. Lewis Hamilton's Mercedes. Wow, Elliot, how cool is that? Yeah, it was really amazing. And um, Hamilton even um, like personally showed us all the buttons. There's a lot to take in, though. Yeah, definitely. But, Nats, there is one thing missing on yes, this table. What's that? We want the best Monaco weekend. Sweets, yes. boys. <laughs> Sweets. Dig Get in. stuck in. Come on. Hey, the party started over here, but we'll put a champagne on ice because Sam Bird's won at Monaco twice. Come on, how are you doing? I feel absolutely fantastic, Crofty. 